Hi, welcome back to uh, my YouTube channel. I haven't done anything for um, well, quite a while, really. Maybe about eighteen months. Um, the reason for that is uh, my camera went pear-shaped, and uh, I just haven't had time to replace it or, or the inclination. Although I did do another boat last year uh, during the lockdown. That one's gone now, um, and then we've we've ended up going back to a, a central. So, as you can see, I've got the keels off it. Um, I've ordered some new studs. As you can see, probably that turning. That one's certainly bent. Um, so, and, and some of them that uh, have, have got a little bit of. Um, corrosion but uh, they've been eaten away a bit so uh, we've got new but the new studs coming for that both keels are off uh, there's the old one lay down there one of the main reasons was because of that crack right the way through and it's coming up here look so that is a bit of a bummer but never mind it's not impossible we can do it um as you see she's not too bad she's original gel coat no paint so that's uh, it's a bonus i hate boats that have been painted because you don't know what the paint's hiding. Um, Bob's still on board with us. He's not here today. But uh, there's a bit of work to be done there. Clean that up. Probably done that on a pontoon or something like that. Um, and she's an old one. Look, got the round four holes, which I prefer to be honest. The uh, the square ones are alloy, and they um, they do corrode. This 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 keel stud there, stub there, that looks to be in pretty good condition. Although once it's cleaned up, we can have a closer inspection. And uh, we've got the. Uh, the rod out. Uh, I've ordered new uh, rudder bushes for that. Um, so, golden opportunity while the boat was up in the air. Um, and I'll take you inside and uh, show you the extent of what we're doing. of April um, we've been working on the project now for two weeks uh, and I think we've done pretty well really in two weeks uh, we've sussed everything out that needs sorting we found that the engine runs and um, we've dropped the keels dropped the rudder uh, so things are going pretty well um, now, uh, today, I've been building the fiberglass up in the in the um, keel stub that uh, has got the crack in it. Well, it hasn't got a crack from inside any longer. Um, you see where we've taken it from, right the way across to there. Um, now, there's three layers there. There's... Um, one layer of uh, 450 gram there's one layer of rovins and another 450 gram on top uh, it, it's got the next thing tomorrow i've got to nib it off clean it up 
acetone it and it'll have another layer of uh, rovins and then on top of that to finish it off another layer of 450 grams um, when I get to that stage then I'll move over to the port side there's not so much to do there that, that's not so bad at all um, so move over that side get that done in the next three or four days probably less hopefully depending on the weather <coughs> um, once that's done then we start building the webs up put them in and then go outside and um, grind off down there on the outside um, where the crack is we've got to go out and grind that crack right the way out and I think we're probably going to be grinding for a minimum of half an inch we've got to take off there so uh, that's, go that's going to take a, b a bit of building back up but it's not a problem um, you know if we cut back far enough um, it should make a good strong job it's no good just grinding the crack out and filling it you've got to go back um, little bits they don't they're not there's no strength there you've got to go back uh, and build it up gradually and uh, you know you've got to take you've got to chamfer it off um, so you start off in the middle with uh, small bits and as you build your layers up you come out further and further um, and that, that's, that's the way to do it and then of course on top of that you got to lay room for your uh, gel coat but um, yeah I'm reasonably happy with it so far yeah yeah um, yeah um, so that's about all we got to report today. Uh, I am, well, maybe I might get time this evening to um, um, edit all this um, and get it on YouTube. I'm quite eager to do that. So that's the report for today. Catch you later.